it's a great to stay. I'm just getting this bad boy fired up. I annoyingly don't think those are gonna fit in there. And stay, maybe the other one will. There you go. There we go. Got my helmet on. Do you not know how to wear these ones in France? And into the pits. A bit late, but for practice. Right, after being on a bit of a go slow this morning. Finally going out for practice. Um, let's try and not get run over by a car. Yeah, cool. Yeah, we're gonna, me and Tyron are gonna try lower rise bars on in the second practice. So, go up and do two or three laps, just fill her out. Right, it's about three hours later and almost at the top with Lou. Highlight of Lou today. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to go on the work site. We've got actually an alright view today, this morning. Got a bit of clouds, but not too many. I bought the big, wrong size gloves up, they're too big for me, but uh, what can you do? We're gonna go for a lap. shot dude God. <coughs> it's slick, eh? Hey? Yeah. So slick. Oh
Wow. <laughs> Slick, hey. Yeah. Oh my god! Right, Torrance just done a quick uh, fire change to the Argos because first sight was quite slippery. So we're getting off again for another one. Yeah. Don't shout at me if I feel really nervous in the dip. Like I won't shout. Like pussy out. We're gonna watch Stacy do this. Um, I'm talking my GoPro. Oh, Stacy do this hip. I'm not. I'll pussy out. <laughs> Don't. You got it. in my wheel.
not the ones. I just caught up with the boys in line over there before the media crew started talking to Bernie and I couldn't even, <laughs> no joking, not joking. Um, that lap was way better, still not really that ideal, but it's like, I got one line which kind of stresses me out, I won't lie, but so I got that one after watching for about five minutes, but hey. Um, there's another couple I want to try, there's a jump at the top, I still have to take off, but watch Stacy do it and seemed all good so I just really don't want to case anything so I just talking a little bee I just really don't want to case anything with my foot like it is fine but I think if I case something it's not gonna be so maybe I'll find Ryan and follow him into this one next lap what do you think you're doing what do you think you're doing off you okay a dog wanting to go outside I've just put my stuff on all ready to go. Gonna head off in like five minutes. Go get in line. Right, we're just here with Ellie. She's got the number one plate this weekend and she's uh sending big off of um off of the corners. What? Not what you wanna do. It's so nice. Bro, I've got a timing chip on, but we're not moving anywhere currently because apparently there's a big crash on the road gap. So we're stuck at the top again, which is fun. In the cold. <laughs> yeah, she's fresh up here, got a bit of wind. But it's okay. We 
we're going up. I'm going up for lap three and a half of the day. We just did a half lap, rolled down the road because someone had a mare. But it's a lovely day out here. The sun's out. It's really cold. The wind's out. It's a bit cold, but we're going to go and do another lap now. And then practice is done. But we've put lower bars on. Now we've pulled the forks, pushed the forks through a bit more because I was getting sore arms. I'm gonna try that. If it doesn't work, put the other bars back on. So oh, I thought I just like dropped something, but I kicked the thing. Um, yeah, ruts are huge, holes are huge. Nice. I landed like at the turn. It's so chill, they fixed the ruts. Fuck, that's so I could have hit it. Yeah. That's annoying. Yeah. I didn't even really pay attention to the fact that they'd fix them. Yeah, I neither. It's way too small, eh? Oh well. Nice oh. job.
are fully. The jump at the top, the ruts were fixed, so I could have done it, but I'd already told myself I wasn't. But I don't know if smaller bars are the way to go. I need to talk to like all the boys and Bernie. Because my arms are so sore. But they could just be the track. So I don't know. Alright, I'm just up the back of the pit. There she is. With the little me on. He's digging a hole in the bushes at the moment. But I'm catching some sun rays after it's been a weird day, I'm not gonna lie. It's been a super weird day. Um just like the lift is so long here it's like half an hour lift time but like that's not including waiting in lines like it took us like an hour for second practice it took most people like an hour only to have the top of the track shut so we had to roll down the road and just go from halfway um and then there's just so many people on track there's it is just so many people on track there's just so many junior boys and like elite and there's elite women and junior women as well um there's just so many people and like it's not a bad thing it's a good thing our sport's like huge now, but it is just absolute chaos. Um, and like, yeah, trying some different things with my bike that maybe isn't working, but I think you can kind of see that with like my elbow pads. I've cut like the bottom seam off there. See if that helped with the arm pump, because I've just got a really gnarly arm pump for some reason. But I think that's a combo of like my elbow pads being too tight, the track, trying new things maybe. Um, but. Tomorrow's a new day. I'm gonna to talk to like Bernie and Barney and like some of the other boys later about should I just go back to my other bars and just run what I know and maybe try things when I'm not at a race. But it's been a weird day. Three and a half laps kind of doesn't seem like a lot. What is it a lot? It doesn't seem like enough. What is this guy doing? Marta, why you go over there, mate? But yeah, I'm just gonna I'm gonna get this uploaded. And tomorrow's a new day.